Oh yeah. I mean, it's fire breath. All right, Ryo and Sukuna, you've done me well, but I want to try this out. Sick man. Yeah, not a very interesting boss, but it was it was okay. And this is Tenkai. This is the dude that turns into Tenkai, right? So this is Akechi or whatever his name is. Recovering so high Amaru, the yokai sling blade Mumio spoke of will require a lot of spirit stones. Okay. In truth, I fear the consequences of dabbling with these stones. But in this case, we must fight fire with fire. Literally. Because I have fire breath now. Heart dragon. Heart Sohaya. Heart emo edgelord. That seems Tokachiro's palace, the Jirokudai, was built with the spirit stone's power. Yeah, of course it was. Just like in the last game. It's high time you paid it a visit. Wait, dude, I thought there was another boss. There's usually three bosses per region. What the fuck's going on? I want to fight another cool boss. Maybe the final boss will be really fucking sick. Who knows? The final boss of the first game was kind of cinematic, but it was very underwhelming. Pilot mission Wings of the Phoenix unlocked. Okay. Missions added to the dojo, the nine symbols. You can now travel to the interim from your starting point. What is the interim? This will take you to the interim. What is the interim? The golden castle. What is this? I don't know what the interim is! Oh, the interim is the, um, afterlife place, huh? With my mom, or whatever. Gotcha, okay. Mataza the spear. Oh yeah, that's the duel against, uh, yeah. That dickhead, which I'll do off screen. Because I already beat his ass once, and I don't want to go back on that and get my ass rocked. Um, that doesn't do very much for me, does it? Uh, let's go more courage. I could always use more courage, honestly. Wait, does it tell me what it does? No, it doesn't tell me what it does. Okay. Uh, next main mission, I guess. Good that Tokichiro has built himself the Jirakudai place in the capital. Apparently it's a kind of castle that glitters like gold. It sounds like a real monument to bad taste, and something about it makes my skin crawl. That glow has surely got to be due to the power of spirit stones, and if Tenkai's words are anything to go by, we're bound to find a huge stockpile of them within. Alright. Let's go. This might be the end of Neo 2, actually. But I don't know if I mentioned it before, but I did buy the season pass, so definitely expect season pass content uh, after it releases. I'll be doing all the DLCs, as I did with Neo 1. Having risen to the preeminent position in government, Tokichiro has had a lavish, ornate, golden blade residence built in the heart of the capital, which he has named Jirakudai. With its stone walls and defensive towers making it more akin to a fortress than a regular abode, the glimmering construction forms a potent symbol of Tokichiro's dreams, driven by his continued thirst for the power of the spirit stones. The intricate design is a testament to the wealth and power of its owner, and the mere sight of this place is said to leave onlookers completely speechless. Alright. Who the fuck is that? Oh, it's Iyasu! Shh. Are you gonna give me your spirit well? Are you dying? He looks like he's dying. Oh, he's impaled! Oh, yeah, he's... He's super dying. He's super, super, super dying. So that must be, uh, Iyasu's ancestor or something like that, I guess. The story of this game is so sick. How you meet this dude and he's like a humble peddler of spirit stones and then... They begin to transform him over time and, like, take advantage of his, like, negative emotions and feelings and shit. And, like, turns it into a thirst for power and shit. I, I kind of had a feeling that's where the plot of the game was headed, honestly, ever since he showed up after I beat Mezuki. So I guess when he was looking at a stone and, like, he saw the reflection, like, that was his inner demons or something, like, showing in the stone or whatever. And, like, that was kind of the beginning or like the turning point of the transformation into the monster he'd become or whatever damn dude the story is so fucking good man
It's so cool. It's very, like, cliche and Japanese-y, but it's awesome. It's super good. I feel like they're telling it really well. Yeah, a moment of silence for our deceased friend. Yeah, but that dude who said, like, oh, I don't think this is blind as you let on, that guy's a fucking idiot. I'm sorry, but fucking dumb. I've never seen any of this. I saw a picture of uh, Giyuki, I saw a picture of uh, Kasha. I fought Maida in a demo. It's a Nagami, okay. And I fought uh, the snake in a demo, and I've seen a Nenra before. Those were all the bosses I had seen. Oh, and Ryoman Sukuna. I saw a little bit of Ryoman Sukuna as well. That's literally it. Like, that's the extent of my knowledge on the game, so... That dude who said I'm not playing blind is a fucking retard. I'm sorry, but... Just stupid. It's really ignorant. What's up, Mumio? Let me take care of the yokai here first. You go ahead. Alright, so that's a shortcut, clearly. So is this gonna be the bullshit palace of traps, dungeons, and dragon style? Am I gonna get, like, brutally fucked and maimed by traps and shit? <laughs> Fucking dickhead! What determines whether I do that? Do I have to be in low stance or something? Hello? Okay, I'm gonna go after you. Nice. Strats. So I'm heading up the Golden Palace, I would have to assume. I hope Tokichiro is not the final boss. Maybe Tokichiro is not the final boss or something. Like, maybe we gotta fight that big evil purple dude with the black and shit going on. And nothing. A lot of doors to open. Seems kind of unnecessary, though, because they all lead to the same place, don't they? Seems a little weird, constructively. Alright, though. This is only one layer. Maybe it gets, like, way cooler the more we go up or something. You are super dead. I was gonna say, if I could aim, you'd be dead, too. That suck. So is this gravity or not? I'm assuming it isn't? No, it's not. Okay. Yeah, you can get the fuck away from me with that, pal. Hello? That's a Yoki, of course it is. Alright, let's try this. Really? Wow. That has a lot of fucking end lag on it. That just got me bodied by a move that I could clearly see coming from a mile away. I'm gonna have to keep that in mind. Alright, so that one doesn't appear that it's gonna be very good for damage. There's a Kodama. I really like that last map, though. That last map was constructively really interesting. Really cool. Something saw me. I don't think it was the dog, either. Oh, something else saw me, for sure. There's a dude, I was gonna say, with a gun shooting me from somewhere. Yeah, so I got the skill that allows me to deflect projectiles. And, uh, I don't know why I didn't get it sooner, because it's super fucking cool. Like, a cannon Yoki can be just, like, looking at you and you do this, and then it just, like, flies right back at him. It does, like, half their health and damage, it's pretty sweet. Nothing? Okay. No, no. It's a painting of a Nenra, I'm gonna touch it, and then a Nenra's gonna spawn, and I'm gonna have a bad time. Probably. So, no thank you. It's gotta be open from the other side. What'd you die by? A down by warrior. Okay, so this one opens. There's a shrine here, but I'm guessing this is the shrine that I already had. Yeah, because Mumio's right there. Alright. So, back into the courtyard, I guess? I want to take care of all these stupid soldiers before I go doing anything dumb. Also, hopefully I get a shit ton of spirit stones up in this bitch. Seeing as how it's practically made of them. Kick. 
No, okay. I really need to follow up to that high attack, honestly. That's the only thing I hate about high stance. I would use it so much more if I had a follow up to that attack. Yep. Fuck off, dickhead. Nice. Alright, he's done. Okay, I, I guess let's bite the bullet and go see what's going on with the Nenro, shall we? Oh, wait, wait a minute. Hello? You're honestly gonna tell me I missed that shit? You're honestly gonna look me in the eye and tell me I missed that shot. Are you serious? I mean, okay, but... <laughs> game's full of shit on that. I don't agree. Wait, so seeing as how those guys are alive, did I ever come in this room? No, I didn't, because there's a dude here. Oh, hello. No, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. Definitely not. I would burst counter that, but I'm very bad at the timing on that particular move, so I usually just play it safe. See, these are breakable. Alright. Nothing, I guess? So I guess to, like, go from floor to floor, you have to, like, beat a painting boss or something? Okay. Alright. I did dodge, but okay. I'm dodging, what the fuck? Really? You're gonna make me start going hard mode, aren't you? Alright, that's it, dude. It's starting to piss me the fuck off. Let's get the bad boss. I rolled. What? That should not have hit me, I was mid-dodge. Whatever. <laughs> sure, dude, whatever you say. Whatever the fuck you say, game. Whatever the fuck you say, bro. Alright. Shitty fucking fight. Crappy boss, whatever. Yeah, okay, it's just like I thought. I'm gonna have to beat a boss per layer. So is the next boss gonna be Yatsu no Kami, or is it only gonna be select bosses? One of them is gonna be Kasha, I assume. Kasha seems like a fight I would have to do in a map like that. I'm trying to think of what bosses would be fitting for that, so I know how to prepare accordingly. Although if Kasha does appear, I have Water Talismans. So, let's see. Kasha, I feel like, is going to be one. Uh, there's nothing water-based that I can think of immediately.
Yeah, that dude has an axe. Can I have some camera, Neo? That dude hits me once. I'm like fucking dead. Maybe not once. Maybe like two or three times. Ooh, shit. God, that was pure reaction right there. Okay, where are the stairs? Here are the stairs. Alright. So I'm guessing there's gonna be like three or four layers to this place, if I had to assume. Ladder that goes down. Fell to death, probably. Nothing on the ceiling. Dude's in here. Okay. Bro. What? Why should they be able to hit me through that? Like, what? Hit the dude with no health. Fuck you. Asshole. That guy's gonna have hyper armor. What? How did he not get hit by that? Okay. Neo hitboxes being shit. Very interesting. That's another layer, so I don't want to go up that way yet. Alright. Dark Realm? Yeah, Dark Realm. Okay. Oh yeah, that doesn't look like final boss material. Nope. Maybe it isn't, who knows. Okay, so that goes downstairs. Which, if I remember correctly, there's a ladder, so I want to go find that ladder again. Yeah, here it is. We are definitely going down here. We're exploring everywhere we can. This is going to be a shortcut, I bet. That doesn't break. Okay. I didn't expect to be able to open it from this side. Oh, I see. This goes down to the first layer, where my shrine is. Gotcha. Okay. I understand. Alright. So I guess the only way to go is up, huh? Okay. Question is, how do we get back to where we could go up? Remember it was somewhere around here. Yeah, here we go. This is what I wanted. Wall? Yeah, wall. Hey, evil yokai. Fucking bird bitch. I'm so sick of the bird cunt. Fuck off. It's not a very smart place to be fighting you. You are not hitting me with that bullshit attack. That shit hurts way too bad. No fucking way. I learned my lesson before. So where does that go? That goes back down onto the bridge. That goes across. Hello? What do you want? Well, that's simple. Alright. Now what? You gonna give me treats? There you are. Am I gonna use any of them? Most likely not. Okay, so if that's the case, then where the fuck do I go? Oh, I know where I go, actually, I think, at least. I have to go back into that place where I saw the uh, Dark Realm on the outside, huh? Where I said that doesn't look like final boss material at all, very sarcastically. How do I get back there? What the fuck? I don't remember how I got there to begin with. Hmm. Oh, here we go. Yeah, here we go. This is it. Since there may be trouble ahead, yeah, me too. There's never only one Gaki. You put him there as a debate to fuck you. Always more than one. Every time. Is this place gonna get all warpy and upside down and like super weird? That's what I was gonna say. He's one of those like stupid demon dudes with the weird stretchy necks. You can always tell because they have a purple bar. And they're usually glowing with like dark ominous energy. Okay, Revenant Graves, Revenant Graves, Revenant Graves. I should see what these people were killed by. Aberrant Soldier. 
Beaten to death by aberrant soldier. Okay. That went better than I expected, honestly, when the Yoki came around the corner. Alright, so if I break this, all this dark shit should fuck off, yeah? Yes. Okay. Only my master and those who serve him may enter here. Leave this place. Alright, well your master is gonna get his ass kicked, hopefully, if I have anything to say about it. Since there may be some connection between the castle and those spirit stones, okay. I'm guessing this is gonna get insanely rough coming up here soon. I'm also guessing that uh, I'm gonna come across the next uh, portrait boss that I have to fight. Something saw me through the wall. This is Yoki, really. I'm so sick of this game, stupid bullshit. It's really fucking annoying. Yeah, would you ex would you like to explain to me how he had enough range to hit me, but I didn't have enough range to connect with my burst counter? I don't that Sorry, that makes zero sense to me. This is gonna be bad. Once you do that first swing, you're locked into that animation too. Can't just cancel it. Bye, please. Alright, he's dead. That ladder goes down. That's a wall. Where's Cisco? Ninja dog. Spiders. Where'd that dog go? There it is. Shit like this is why I go floor by floor by floor. Fuck you. How did that not break his horn? Okay. Again, Neo. Come on, dude. I'm at a loss. Break the fucking horn when I hit it, please. <laughs> Super annoying. Especially on an enemy that can kill you in half a second. Back up. No other Gaki? Okay. For the first time in Neo 2 history, there hasn't been a second Gaki. Crazy. Nothing? No bullshit? Okay. Right. No Kodama? None of those walls with eyes, the Nurikabe? No secret down here? No, there doesn't appear to be. Okay. Guess we're out of here then. Yeah, I was gonna say, actually, wasn't there another place I could go to? There's a scampus, which I will take with me. Get out of this castle of horrors with. There we go, now I have an evacuee buddy. And he rolls around, which is super efficient. Hmm? Yeah, this puts me back where I've been before. This is new. The autumn leaves are ablaze. Can't be easy to maintain this place. Probably not. Rokichiro must have gathered many spirit stones to end up with such a splendid castle. Yeah, if only the world had all of them, right? No more poverty, no more hunger, no more homelessness. And, uh, as a cool side product of it, you get really sick horns. Kodama in here, but nothing to guard it. I don't believe you. That also wasn't very well hidden, so again, I don't believe you times two, but okay. Well, let's break all of Tokachiro's shit. Fucking douchebag living in the lap of luxury. After his saltiness overcame him and he had to fucking stab me in the chest. Fucking sore loser. He's a little bitch. 
That's like the most dishonorable form of PvP I've ever seen. I beat his ass in one try so he gets super pissy, and then he builds a super fucking sick castle and comes back to life and kills me. Cause he's just mad. That is insane bullshit. I super disagree, but okay. Do whatever you want, game. Piece of shit. Fuck you both. Idiots. I was playing that super smart. Alright, so there's an Ubume over there. Dark Realm. How can I go about this smart? It's a great question, isn't it? That looks like a set of stairs that come down or something. No, those seem way too long. Alright, new shrine. I'll take it. I'll fucking take it. Oh wait, no, I must have already rested here. Wait. Is this new? Yeah, I must have already rested here. Yeah, because this is the way I came down, so I don't need to rest at the shrine and respawn everything. Oh, fuck me, Neo. Almost. You almost got me. In fact, I'm quite lucky that you didn't. Oh, not in a listening mood, are we? You must be very brave. Or really stupid. My money's on the ladder, honestly. Okay. Is that dude is still alive? There's another portrait up there, huh? Oh, it's Yatsu no Kami. I gotta fight Yatsu no Kami again? Motherfucker, dude. I don't like that boss. Alright, well at least I know what boss it is, so I better get my antidotes ready. I do not believe that this could be that long of a map, so it's probably only going to have me fight the first three bosses or so again. That's the place that I've already been down into, I think. Nice job, idiot. Give that dude a raise. Ninja Lux? Hell yeah. Yeah, this is Yatsu no Kami. There's a door here, but I'm guessing I have to go through Yatsu no Kami to be able to unlock it. That makes sense. Fucking Yoki, piece of crap. Dickhead. Look up, nothing, alright. Nothing gonna shoot at me, nothing evil. There's an item down there that I want. Assuming it's easy to get, shit. Hello there. Easy. Alright, where's my item at? There it is. Wait, isn't that one of Tokachiro's dudes? So is Tokachiro just killing off his own guys? That's what people who get, like, really power-hungry typically end up doing, huh? Again, that's why you never work for the bad guy. That's exactly why. Work for the hero, yeah, you may encounter some hardship or whatever, but, like, at least you can always trust them. Unless they turn corrupt or some shit. Tokichiro is just a fucking dickhead. What do these do? These don't do anything for me, do they? They really don't. Is there any, like, resistance to anything that I can get? Yeah, see, elixir that can be carried by one, but I haven't done the mission. Sucks ass. I don't need any of this shit, honestly. I really don't. All this stuff I can't get. Whatever. Really fucking annoying that you have to do shit like that. Alright, let me get my antidotes ready so I can fight Yatsu no Kami better. Because I'm assuming he's going to be just as fucking shitty as he was before, if not shittier. Now I have better gear and they're going to scale him in accordance. I had to guess. Where are my antidotes? Where are my fucking antidotes? I know I have some. 
There they are. Okay. Now we're fine. Lantern plant fruit. Alright, let's go. Ready for you this time, you fucking piece of shit. Terrible at timing that burst counter, apparently. What? I dodged. Easy boss. Grateful for, to you for ridding the world of my corrupt being. You're welcome, Yatsunokami. 